All right, I just finished three quick pet battles, and um, I got each of my guys to level 10. So now we're going to go fight Cassandra, who all of her guys are level 11. Um, they're all uh, mechanical types, so I don't have any elemental pets high enough level. Like, I remember when considering the team that I was making this particular fight in mind, just wondering how it's gonna fare. Um, Cause sometimes this can be a hiccup for different people. Here, I'm gonna throw out my Sandstorm, which makes it so his Demolish is only gonna be a 40% hit chance. And of course, okay, so get this. He hits me with a 40% hit chance and I miss him with a 90% hit chance. Just keep missing. Nice crit, Mr. Anubis. Okay. Oof, that hurts. Throwing down another sandstorm, reduces hit chance. Yeah, I don't think this fight's gonna be a problem. I think I'm going to be able to beat it. Okay. Right. What's awesome is this guy, since he's got launch. Ooh, that hurts. I was hoping that he'd just go for it pretty earlier on. Okay. Alright, I'm going to throw out. Oh! Poop on a stick. Uh, what do you guys say? We'll go Chrominius. Okay. Alright, Chrominius. Oh, stinker. I was hoping he would stay alive long enough to counter the liftoff. So I'm using Ravage there to get some health back. I have my Racial active. That's interesting. He's using Repair right off the bat. Um, I can use this as a free switch. Do I care? Not really. Um, here's what I'll do. So I know he's going to get all of his health back. So I'm going to hit him with Howl here. And let's see, that hits for 130, that hits for 130. So let's hit the same amount. Oh, triple hit city. Okay. Now this is where I'm going to switch out. Supercharged, no bueno. I can hit insanely hard. Was that his supercharge? No, that was his batter. Okay, because I outspeed him on the uh, MPD, it's actually working out fairly well. So he's going to go down. He's going to come back. Probably launch repair. Nope. Bomb hits him. Okay. And I win the fight. Unfortunately, I did lose my Anubis. So it means he will not get the giant boost of experience. Um, that my other two pets will, so I'm gonna have to fight a handful more pets. Okay, um, apparently we gotta go back to Ogremar, so we will hearth. I got my heal on cooldown, okay, apparently I can't use that while I'm hearthing. Oh, maybe his, heart, his hearthstone is set to, uh, yeah. I set it to Dalarand. I forgot that. It's my death knight that I set to Ogremar. But don't worry, this is only one quick click away. Um, small side note, if you are having ridiculously long load times in Dalarand, like longer than two minutes, you can go... Here, I'll show you. 
you go into your Battle.net client, you go to settings, and you come down here and you unclick use browser hardware acceleration when available. Now, I'm not sure what exactly that is, uh, but I read an article on Wowhead that my GM had posted in our uh, Discord, and it was like, this will speed up your load times, and it drastically speeded up my load times. So, yeah. Don't know why, but it does. Okay. Now we're going to go talk to Vazagrothoroth. You know, today is the first day of 7.2, and everybody is getting their flying out in the Broken Isles and, you know, getting their class exclusive mounts. And what am I doing? I'm doing pet battles on my brother's account because I am so cool. All right. So what do you say, Vazrock? He said, well done, Darth Greeny. You were finally prepared to truly come into your own as a tamer. Battle Tamer's Kalimdor. Now that you have a chance, or had a real chance to hone your skills, you've, you're ready to venture into the world of pet battles in full. Oh, you hear that, guys? We're going to go venture into the world in full. There are five tamers throughout Kalimdor that I'd like you to defeat. Traitor Gluck in Feralis, Gazel the Great in Duskwalla Marsh, uh, Kala Grimtotem in Thousand Needles, Zoltan in Fellwood, and Elena... Um, Flutterfly in Moonglade. I'm kind of. I'm really far away from my monitor right now. I hurt my back weightlifting yesterday, and so I'm sitting in an easy chair, like ten feet away from my monitor. Uh, okay, defeat those tamers. Cool. Let's go do that. And then the Eastern Kingdoms. There are five tamers there. David Cross. Hmm. I wonder if those are neutral tamers or if those are alliance specific. We shall find out. Okay. So. I know I need to defeat Trader Gluck. He's level 13. I already beat Cassandra. Uh, level 14. Yeah, I think he's next. Okay, so that'll do it for this part. I'm going to fly down to uh, Feralis or Feralis, and that's where we'll continue the series.